The state library says its most important Boer War collection has been systematically stolen in an inside job. About 200 items have disappeared, including diaries and letters. The state library's been in the wars. Someone's been helping themselves to a Boer War collection. It's very sad, Simon. Our collection, part of our collection, a valuable part of our collection, an irreplaceable part of our collection has been stolen. These are similar items. Journals, maps, a compass, an engraved fob watch, all belonging to Captain Samuel White, who served in the SA Boer War contingent. Not a trace of him is left. He's been expunged from history. The theft was discovered late last year, but it could have happened up to five years ago. The public doesn't have access to where the collection was stored. We're all trying very hard here at the library not to be Hercule Poirot or Miss Marple. Shoot straight, you bastards! Don't make a mess of it! The Boer War was the young colony's first military commitment to the Empire. Historians deplore the loss. It's really a very serious act, I think, and whoever's done it should try and make it good as quickly as possible. Alan Smith concedes the library's been remiss, but in 181 years, nothing like this has happened. Someone has betrayed the trust of the people of South Australia. It's so often the way in major institutions, it so often is an inside job. I remember a story years and years and years ago at the Museum of Victoria, parts of the coin collection were going and it ended up being the curator of numismatics who was funding his retirement. Security has been tightened and he says no one's allowed alone in the collection now. Simon Royal, ABC News, Adelaide.